Hi everybody and welcome back to a brand new video. For those who are new here, hi, I'm Nadine, a mom of two. And on my channel, you'll find mostly motherhood lifestyle and organizational videos from your um, cleaning videos to your organizational videos, cooking, anything mother related you'll find on my channel. If you have been here a couple of times, thank you so much for your support. Every subscriber helps, every like helps, every comment helps. Um, so, as most of you know, who have been here more than once or twice or thrice, um, I love cooking. I spend a lot of my time in my kitchen. Um, I love preparing breakfasts, lunches, suppers, but my favorite must be supper. Um, I spend most of my time and I feel like when I do cook, it's me time. I stand alone in this kitchen, nobody else is around me, and I get to do what I love to do and that is cook so i was new to cooking marvin and myself only married for three years and i'm going on four years and i kind of was thrown into the deep end and i didn't know what to do i didn't know how to cook i didn't know um i would watch my mom cook and i would like peel a potato here and chop an onion there but it was never like full force cooking so once getting married it's obviously something that i had to do there was no other way that it would have gotten done if i don't do it um so I thought I would share with you guys a couple of things, um, groceries that we pick up on a monthly basis. By monthly, I mean like twice a month we do go shopping. Um, and yeah, so we got our first batch today, which is our, like, you know, the loss is probably the first two weeks or so. And then we'll go in the middle of the month and we'll get some more. So it just all depends. It all depends on specials and sales and we are also preparing for Easter and Chase is so excited because his dad got him some Easter crafts and Easter fun Easter things to do so he's very excited he loves baking so we will definitely be having something to do with Easter in my videos in my future videos so keep an eye out for that so oh my word I'm sweating this light is hot um so I would just like to show you guys what we pick up um, so basically we shop at different stores, um, mostly there's only, hmm, I'm just counting now on top of my head, we buy at two stores, which is usually, our go-to stores is, uh, three stores, our go-to stores is Pick and Pay, Spa and Food Lovers, I could live in Food Lovers, um, I love it, and then we've also added Cab Foods monthly to our list, um, because I am getting more into the baking and the feel of baking. Marvin's the baker, um, but I am also trying to put in my little bit when it comes to baking. So what you'll see today is pick and pay, um, food lovers, and where we buy our meat, which is Joey's, um, Joey's um, meat, meat shop, basically. Um, it's a Joey's Place fabric. I think it's called, uh, but I've already taken the things out of the um, out of the packaging because I actually like off fit because I get big portions of off everything, my meats and my sausage and so on. And yeah, so let's get back into the video. If you guys enjoy this, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell so you can get an upload every time. Get a notification every time I upload a new video. That is a mouthful. So. Without further ado, let's get started. So first we've got our bacon. This is prime cut bacon. It's one kilogram. This we pick up at Cab Foods. Not all the time, but I'm guessing he feels like some bacon. I'm not sure the price range, but I think this could be about between 80 and 90 Rand for this kilogram. This would last us a good month. Um, then we get to Joey's, which is the burgers. This is one packet of burgers. It comes in 10 packs. So we, this is our monthly... Um, monthly burgers that we get and then we get the sausage and we get the mince and we get the other sausage sorry this is yes this is cheese sausage and then mince and then normal sausage so um, this is only half the portion of the sausage I'm actually frying some now as we speak and this is half the mince so because we're only four people that eat or technically only three because I feel like I always have to make chase um, a separate meal um this actually is enough for three of us no matter what i make whether it's spaghetti bolognese or anything like that um this is usually enough then he picked up at food lovers 
Pewal canola oil. This was on special today. I don't know till when, but it is 70 rand for the two. And then my best friend, Cab Foods, wooden spoon, um, bake, baking butter, <clears throat> soot cookies. This is chocolate chip pieces, and then the two chocolate chocolate chip and chocolate um, cookie dough. And then he also picked this up for Chase because Chase was nagging. He wants to make Easter eggs, so he got this mold. I've never worked with it before, but we will see how that goes. Um, this was all at Cab Foods. Then he picked up three Pringles. It was on sale, 50 Rand for three, I think. And then we've got all our greens over here, which is lettuce um green peppers so my green peppers when he buys it in bulk like this or i call it bulk i don't know if it is bulk but um i would usually chop them up and then i would chop them up and then freeze them in bags and it lasts really well he's got we've got some cucumber some dragon fruit i've never had dragon fruit like this before so i'm really excited i would i did buy quite a while ago i bought dragon fruit at a um, frozen fruit place and it was really nice I would throw it in my smoothies and then he picked up a liquid fruit for Jay's baby spinach for smoothies grapes and then two cauliflower and broccoli packs so this is what he got from the first three stores um, food lovers cab foods and Joey's so this is the three and then I will show you guys the rest just now. Okay, so essentials is usually like milk. Um, so he bought, you'll see on the other side, I also have some milk. He bought two six packs of milk and then he got some chocolate and then these sweets for Jay's for church tonight just to keep him busy. Some marshmallows, wafers also. Um, I'm guessing this is for him to snack on yogurt and then I want to try making um, like a taco or like a taco bowl or something like that it's <laughs> leo so whole kernels then this beans is not for that but yeah i got some beans and then some black beans tomatoes to put in the tacos fatties fatties and monies and macaroni he loves peanut butter and baked bread worcestershire sauce sugar coffee these eggs these eggs we usually go for the bigger one but the bigger ones are like 80 rand at the moment so that's why i took the 18 and we have some in the fridge still uh cheese chicken spice tomato paste because i use a lot of tomato paste in my dishes um noodles for jace mayo sour cream to go with the tacos this is Nutri-Day plain yogurt for Leo, uh, tonic water, we know what that's for, some iron brew, spa litter, tomato paste, this is rooibos tea, and then his, and then the berries, and then extra stuff is like his Navia Chaser's toothpaste, Leo's wipes, the rest of the milk. And then this paper towel. So that is basically what we will use like for the next two weeks. So basically every week I try to sort of jot down the ideas for my cooking. And that's just what I'm showing you guys what I'm doing here. This doesn't take too long and it really helps when... Um, when you don't exactly know what you want to make that evening, I would literally switch it out depending on whether, if it's hot, I would prefer like, you know, your more um, easy cooking and when it's a bit more windy, like we are starting to get a lot of wind now, I would prefer my curries and things. So that's basically just what I do. Yeah, also, um, I write down things that I need and basically just take it from there so i'm just showing you guys my week one of planning which is basically everything and usually on a friday we would eat um easier meals and then sunday obviously your sunday lunch so that is what we have here and it's easy to do